my dear students today in this video i am going to explain about the class 3 social studies the first term book chapter 2 globe and maps first of all we have already studied that the earth is round in shape the earth is so big that we can see only a part of it at one time therefore we have to make a model of the art to study it. Means it is difficult to see a round thing at a side. Moreover, the art is so large in size that we cannot see all its parts at a time. So, in this chapter, we will study about the art using globes and maps. Globe a globe is a small model of the art. It is shaped just like the art. It helps us to observe different places on it. Means a globe is a very small model of our art and globe helps us to know many things about the art. However, on a globe we cannot see all the places at one time. We can see only half of the art at a time on a globe. We need to rotate the globe to see the remaining half. Means it is difficult for us because we cannot see all the places at one time on a globe. We need to rotate the globe to see all the places on the globe. If we observe the globe carefully, we will see some blue areas and these are known as water bodies. Means, these blue colors determine the water areas of our art, which is known as water bodies. And the areas shown in different colors are land. The globe is very useful, but it has many limitations. It is very difficult to show small places even on a globe. To show them in detail, we need a big globe. A big globe will be difficult to carry. These problems can be solved with the help of a map. Means, globe is very useful for us but as well as it have so many difficulties such as it is very difficult to show the small places on a globe. And we need a big globe to show the small places. But the big globe will be difficult to carry from one place to another. Map A map is a drawing of the whole art or a small part of it on a flat surface. Maps are easier to make. A map can be drawn even on a simple paper. We can fold it, roll it and carry it whenever and wherever we want. We can hang it on the wall. Means the map is a drawn or printed representation of the art or any other places. And it is very easy for us to make and also we can draw in a simple paper and we can easily fold it, roll it and carry it in different places. A book of maps is called an atlas. Maps can be of the whole art, a particular country or even a very small place. Oceans and continents. Look at the map given in the next slide. And this is a world map showing oceans and continents. Very big bodies of water are called oceans. There are total 5 oceans in the world and these are the Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, the Indian Ocean, the Arctic Ocean and the Antarctic Ocean. The Pacific Ocean is the biggest ocean in the world. This is Pacific Ocean. And the Arctic Ocean is the smallest ocean in the world. This one. Oceans are not flat beds. There are mountain ranges, volcanoes and trenches on the ocean floor. Means floor of the ocean are not smooth. They have different mountain ranges, volcanoes and trenches. Big areas of land are called continents. 
there are seven continents in the world and they are asia africa north america south america europe australia and antarctica asia is the largest continent in the world this one and australia is the smallest continent in the world this one our country india falls in asia this one asia and this part is india directions in a map there are four main directions east west north and south these directions help us to locate the places on a map means with the help of these four directions we can locate different places on a map put up a map on the wall and observe it the top of the map indicates the north the bottom shows towards the south the right indicates the east and the west comes on the left what is a compass the compass has a needle that always points towards the north once we understand where north lies we can find out the other directions means with the help of a compass we can find our directions mainly the sailors they use compass to find out their directions